Let's have a look at the Android Automotive architecture. Here is a high level architecture diagram. As we could see, the car specific modules are developed in parallel to the standard common Android modules. The automotive modules are mostly independent modules, but in some cases, they might be extending base classes of standard Android modules. At the top layer, there are the system, OEM and third party apps. These are pure Android apps, which is developed in Java or Kotlin using Android Studio. As the second layer from top, we have Android Framework API and Car API. Android Framework API belongs to the standard Android OS and Car API is added as part of Android Automotive. In the third spot from the top, there is the Car Service and the Android System Service. Car Service belongs to Android Automotive and Android System Service is from the native Android. Both communicates each other. In fact, car service is actually started by system server. At the bottom, there is the vehicle hall which talks with the vehicle hardware. It's an interface to the vehicle bus and other hardware drivers mostly developed by the OEM or their third party vendors. Okay, I will keep this section short. We will have a look at the source code and explore these modules in next section.